Oh, okay. Uh, you guys remember Chuck Lloyd? Oh, you might not. Um, uh, roll a clip, Carlito. Apparently, Chuck Lloyd, he's like a war veteran, and he's like being haunted by these ghosts. And like some other things, like uh, apparently he like lives in a constant loop of death or something, and lives life as a, they, like there's a lot of like different stories I've heard. Oh, so uh, yeah, a, th a thing about um, Chuck Lloyd is uh, we're friends now, and uh, he has sent me a message. Oh, let's see what message he did uh, uh sent me. So I. Said, hey, boy! And I also said, I need some answers on this shade light thing. I mean, you guys remember that? The big spooky uh shade light. They're like the group of myths, and there's a lot of weird secrets about them, and it's a lot of weird stuff. So he says, bad manners mix for bad guests. So I'm guessing he didn't feel like answering that question. So I said, man, I am so sorry about that, Jack Lloyd. He said, quite all right, come over for some tea. I said, we'll do this week. I got a busy day today. What did I have to do today at uh, midnight? Nothing. I wanted to play Fortnite. I wanted to play Fortnite for like eight hours and then sleep. So he says, it's very rude to decline an offer. I say, oh, oh no, Chuck Lloyd, come on. I'm just, you know me, boy. Can we do it later? So he says, bad manners makes for bad guests. 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 Uh, I think I can fit it in today. How about now? You've convinced me, Chuck Lloyd. This man has literally intimidated me into having tea with him when I wanted to go play Fortnite. I had things I wanted to do, Chuck Lloyd. Why did you have to use your beauty and charm to manipulate me, Chuck Lloyd? Okay, so he's actually at his place right now. So why, why don't I just swoop by, you know, uninvited and just... just see what's going down, you know? Uh, I really, uh, I'll have you know, do you remember when I met Gaz the Clown? I hate meeting these guys. I hate it. It's weird. It's creepy. I don't know if they're just gonna do something not nice to me. So, uh, as you can see, Chuck Lloyd is here. So is a lot of other people. You guys know where he is? He invited me over for some tea. Oh, oh, Albert, get back. Oh, well, I was invited over. Yeah, apparently, uh, nobody's allowed on his lawn right now. Is that, oh, he's looking through the window. Oh, he says in the chat, bad manners make for a bad guess. Why, why is he not messaging me back? Why is he not message? He's just in there, not messaging me. Oh my God, why is that guy going in? Dude, stop, stop, stop. Playing in the grass. That's a bad idea. He, say, he keeps saying bad manners makes for bad guests. He keeps saying it. Look in the chat. He's like peeking through the window. Chuck, I'd like to accept your offer on the tea. I'm quite parched. Why is he so upset with me? Should we invite one of them in, Sandra? What? Is there somebody in here named Sandra? Oh, wait, on the phone! When we went when we went on the phone in his house, we tried to call someone named Sandra, but they wouldn't answer. Is she dead? Probably. Is he talking to a dead person? Probably. Stop pushing me on the grass, idiots! I invited him, dear. Bad manners make for bad guy. What? Is he having an argument with his wife now? I don't. This is. This makes me so uncomfortable. Where are you waiting for? Go have some tea, Mr. Doodle. Do you think like that's just something I I could just walk up up there and do do that do? He just said again. Bad manners make for bad guests. He invited me earlier. I'm just waiting for him to finish what he's doing, guys, because he's just in there. Oh, he peeked out. Hello, Chuck. How are you doing? I bought your shirt. Dude, do you not understand what's going on? He needs to look at me waving to him. It's rude to keep a guest waiting. Come in. Oh, God. Okay, let me just... Oh, hey, guys, 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 guys. Guys, please stay back. You were kicked for this game. Unspecified reason. He literally said it's rude to keep a guest waiting. Come in. Why would he do that? Chuck, uh, you asked me to come in. I didn't mean to wrong you. Very confused, Chuck. You're giving me mixed emotions. I'm gonna come back in. This is quite the thing that's going on. I was kicked again? He asked me to come in! That guy's okay! He's okay! Not me, though! Why, of course. All right. I, is, is there, like, a hacker in this game that's kicking me? What's happening? Bad manners make for... But what did I do wrong this time? I only invited you. All right, I'm just gonna go in. Hello. Good manners makes for good guests. Hello, my friend. Wave. He invited me in because I'm hot. Have a seat. I insist. I'll sit. Oh, okay. Can't sit on that one. I'll sit here. All right. So I think this is a really good guy. Can I get you something? All right. Got to use my manners. May I have some tea, please? Wow. What a guy. Where's he getting out of a microwave? I'm so nervous right now. I'm so nervous, guys. Seems I burnt it. <laughs> That's fine, Chug. Don't beat yourself up over it. And definitely don't beat me up over it. Do you hear it? The music? Yes, it's great. No! Oh, not 
Oh, yep, no, not the music. Can't hear that. The television, I love this show. The voices. Um, yeah, the, the, they're a bit quiet, though, so I don't know what they're saying. Just in case, that's like a loophole in case he asks me what they're saying. Then you know what it's like. Yes, Chuck, we're, we're you know, we have a lot in common. So we're gonna be friends, okay? Every day, same voices. Peck, peck, pecking at your brain. Yeah, dude. Oh, uh, we seem to have a lot in common. That's why we're friends. Oh my God. Sit. Oh, uh, okay. Sorry, sorry. Sit down. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Chuck! It's rude to get up without being excused. My apologies. Jeez, this guy's like calling me out on every single one of my bad manners. Like, I I, I actually, I, I feel like I'm learning a lot from this. Shall we head to the garden? Wait, wait, I got this. Sure, may I be excused? You know, I'm just gonna excuse myself. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? They're like all judging me, look. Hi, Chuck. Plants are coming in nicely. Wow, they are. Pesky crows nicking a few of them. Stupid crows. Oh, someone's hiding by the tree. <laughs> he just looked at him and he goes running back to the road. I don't want to go in his room. Oh, pardon me. Look how well-mannered I'm being. I'm not even going in his room because like, I don't, I need to check the laundry, but you're welcome to come with. Sure. I'd love to just check on the laundry with you in here. Let me just, boop. I don't like this. I don't like this. Come with me. Okay. What are we doing? What if they all just start charging in the house? house. The doors are locked. Oh, okay. We're going into his basement. We've been here before, if you don't know, but we couldn't see anything because it's so dark. Like, so now we actually get the, yay, who turned on the lights? Please turn on the lights. Nobody here except us. Just us now. Just some one-on-one -on -one time. Never cared for this place. Uh-oh. Bad manners make for bad. Oh, yep. Get these guys out of here. They're bad. They're bad guests. Chuck, I am sorry that you have to deal with that. Trust me. It's just so difficult. You know what? I, I, I know what you mean, Chuck. They follow me around everywhere every single day. How rude of them. How rude of you guys. Oh, we're going over here. So we're going over here. You want me to just come with you? Laundry needs to be dried again. Um, here, wait, I know how to make this not sound rude. It's a bit dark. I need to watch my step. Let's head back up then. Okay. Uh, oh, nighttime. Oh, God. 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 I don't like this. Wow, he lit the room with candles just for me. So romantic. Don't. Don't what? What does he mean, don't? I didn't realize we were down there for so long. He is right. He, it is nighttime now. Wait, what is that? Show yourself, demon! The guy can't figure out how to, how to get out of there. He says just stay in the light. All right, I'll get a slightly closer to the candle then. Um, it's really dark. What's he doing? What's he looking at? I'm having a good time with you. Just really wanted to break the silence. No! Oh, sorry. Yeah, my, my mistake. Chuck Lloyd. This is stressful. Don't you see them? Yeah, I do. Oh, God. So it is true. He really is haunted by ghosts. Oh, no. You're making a big mistake coming out of here, buddy. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> That's actually a perfect hiding spot. Oh, not anymore. Have you ever woken up in the middle of the night? Yes, I have. And seen something hiding in the dark part of your room? That's them. What do you think they want, Chuck Lloyd? Tell your boy how you feel. This is therapy. Okay, so he doesn't, he's not answering me. So, uh, they try to make me sleep, but I never listen. I just wake up and have deja vu the next day. Being awake is more fun anyways. All right, there's a lot. This is like, this is the worst adopted race of baby role play ever. You fools. Sorry, should I go? What, what do you think? Stay out of darkness for your own good! Oh, wait, yeah, they're, they're going into the dark. Th oh, wait, in the last video about this, I went into the darkness. The thing is, that video isn't up yet, so Chuck Lloyd doesn't know that I kind of, like, went through his house. Oh, God. I feel like he's actually, like, next time we visit, he might... He might actually unfriend me after this video goes up. Because I haven't released that video yet, so Chuck doesn't really know that I kind of was snooping around a little bit. If you're watching this, I'm sorry. Oh, he's looking at me now. Let me just make eye contact. Stay out of the dark parts! No telling where they'll turn up! They'll turn up? Hey, that's my boy right there! Turning up! Hey, hey, hey. Turn up, boy! <laughs> yeah! You can hear them, right? Yes! Maybe I'm not crazy. Oh, God! Oh, no, no, wait, wait, wait! Wait, Chuck! Wait, wait, wait! Where'd he go? Oh, God, this is not good. He said- He told all of us to not go in the dark- The darkness, I see something. You! When I was here last, I did not see those. I swear, I did not see those. That's- That's actually- I don't like this. I'm very uncomfortable. Good thing I have all my buddies with me. Oh, God. There it is again. Chuck. No, 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 Chuck. No, 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 Chuck. No. Chuck, maybe they're intimidated and shy. You ever think about that, Chuck? No. You never think about anyone. I see him. Chuck, come on. Chuck, you can't catch him. He's the one. Don't you see? Despacito's the one for me. The only way I'll get this chance is if I just go to sleep. He left. He just actually, he, he just, he's gone. Chuck, I, I hope, I hope you're feeling better. You seemed stressed. All right, so Roblox, Roblox has a trash uh, moderation system. So, uh, bad manners make for, 
Oh god, wait, is he is he mad at me for leaving? God, sorry, 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 I'm coming back, I'm coming back. Okay, so wait, maybe he woke up now. Maybe he's awake now from his sleep. Bad mares make for bad, 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 bad. You know what? I'm just going back in. You know what? Wait, now I feel like it was all a dream. That's what I think he thinks he feels like. Wait, maybe I can manipulate him into thinking it's tea time again. Hey, Chuck, I was invited for tea. May I come in? This is not smart of me. This isn't a bad thing I'm doing. It's like I'm keeping, I'm being nice to him. I'm keeping him company. Should we let him in? So oh, God, it's literally the repeat of what? Oh, so he just lives this same day over and over again. He said the same ex- Like, look, what? I invited him to here. Same exact thing happening. It's rude to keep a guest waiting. Okay. I'll come in, Chuck. No, not you, Clank. You're a kid. Why is he doing this again? Here, what I what I say last time? Uh, here, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say the exact thing. I didn't mean to wrong you. Yeah, that, that's that's what that's what I said when I got kicked last time. Right, now let me just try to get back in again. Oh my God! <laughs> Why, of course? Scrub. up. Why, of course? All right, if it lets me in the. Uh, so I think I have to get back in the server and then get kicked again so I can say the other message So I think he's gonna kick me again. Have a seat. I insist. Can I get you something? May I have some tea, please? This is gonna be a six hour long video until one of us uh, eventually gets tired So it's gonna be doing the same exact thing. I want to see if something different happens this time There's got to be something different. It seems I burnt it. That's okay. I don't want to set the world on fire. <gasps> we didn't go in the shed last time. We didn't go in the shed. No. Oh, I was excited. I thought we were going to go in the shed. Mr. Flip Flops. Stop calling me Mr. Flip Flops. Oh, and that guy over there again. Wait, that's kind of weird. Pesky cr what? That guy was over there last time. Why is he there again? And he did the same... All right, whatever. There's a lot of things slightly different. That guy walked uh, back to the road last time. Oh, okay. He's turning around really slowly. Hi. You know, I swear that scarecrow is watching me. Oh, the one over there? Should we check? Probably my imagine. Yeah, no, you're right. All right, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stay over here. I'm gonna let him let me in again. Pardon me. My God, I, I, this is, it's so much more uncomfortable this time. I need to check the laundry, but you can come with if you'd like. Sure. I wonder if anything different will happen this time. Please, I want to see what's in the what's in the darkness. Okay, wait. I didn't get this. He didn't. I didn't really get to say this last time. Never cared for it down here. A bit dark in here. I should watch my step. Hot boy Carlito has made an appearance. Please, please stop. Wait. Okay, this is different. I'm trying to imply it so we can light up the place. Dark. Th oh God. Oh, he he said a code. He said a code. He said a code. He said a code. He did, he did a code. I hope no one follows us. No, people are following us. Gets a bit dark down here. So that's where the flashlight is. I think he's going to kick out everybody. Oh, yeah, they're not supposed to. So he said darkness incarnate. That's a code right here. That opens this little secret door. He, right now, he's just banning all of them. I'm your grandma. Hot boy Carlito. Oh, yeah, that guy's smart. See, he said darkness incarnate and the door opened. And he left. It got kicked. We can see you. Hi. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I wasn't down here last time. I didn't know this was an actual thing. I had no clue yeah no you lead the way feel like i haven't been here in ages yeah i mean me me too sir oh uh, he's like i feel like he's purposely taking me down a certain path so i don't see too much or maybe there's like a maze yeah this is i hear someone following us there's somebody like clicking the flashlight back there like it like in the rust videos oh she kind of looks like me you know maybe just a coincidence that kind of looks like me one thing's for sure, this doesn't lead to the laundry. <laughs> yes, ah, this feels so new. Should we do some exploring to remember? There's nobody there. Chuck, Chuck, there's nobody there. My gut tells me we should stay away from that. Oh, I wanna go, I wanna go near it, but I don't wanna make him mad. Who are you? Sometimes you gotta take a risk. Makes life fun, right? Well, that's not, Chuck Lloyd, you know I hate bad words. I'm sure there's nothing important there. What? He saw hot boy Carlito and he said what? Because he was at a loss for words. Hot boy Carlito. <laughs> no, I invited him. Oh, is Sandra? Is Sandra talking to you? Oh, God. He shouldn't have to go through that. Go through what? <laughs> <laughs> Sandra, I'm a good boy. He's my guest. Just here for tea. I like how it like out of everybody, hot boy Carlito is. No, I remember, but it's wrong. What? Oh, okay. He's looking at me now. Or, I'm sorry. Could you? Oh, yeah. I'm so sorry. They don't like that. Oh, oh, I okay. I, ugh. I think there's something in there. He doesn't want me to see wherever we go next is 
Definitely something he doesn't want me to see. Please do wait here. Of course. And so badly do I want to just like, just r make a break for it and just run. I wouldn't want you to see this. Are you sure? Wait, wait, wait. I kind of want to, I kind of want to see it. Want to see it. Chuck. Lloyd. I see somebody over there. Oh, oh God. Oh God. I'm only in prison here. Uh, just gonna server lock on. Meaning nobody can hear my screams besides Chuck. And you guys. Oh, sorry, sorry, I turned on the light. Well, that takes care of that. <laughs> ah, good one, good one, Chuck. Smiley face. Managed to grab some detergent as well. We're having a productive day. I need to come back here. I like, after this, I really wanna come back here. Stop it! Oh God, oh, me? Me or you? Or the, the ghost that you see? I told you! He's a guest! Oh, it's Sandra. Sandra. I mean, you guys know. I mean, uh, Sandra. Let's hurry along. Yep. Yep. Sure. Of course. They don't like you here. Okay. Well, you know, seems like every school I've ever been to, every public event I've ever been to, seems like every YouTube I have been to. I'm having a bad day. I'm starting to feel like Chuck doesn't even like me that much. Like, when I say like, I mean like, like me. This way, maybe? I hope he takes- Oh, no, no, no. I wanted to- Yes, no, I wanted to go the wrong way. I gotta go back there and explore. Or one of you guys, maybe. I'm not encouraging you to go on Chuck Lloyd's property. I'm just saying it's interesting. That's all. Yes, I know. Well, I had a good time. All right, let's see. Let's see what's around here. Oh, it's pretty normal. Pretty normal. Just had to sneak a few peeks. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, the clothes aren't even in there. Idiot. Forgot I had the detergent right there. Oh man, we walked all that way for nothing, huh? Ah, what a doozy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh. Looks like it needs to dry a bit longer. You really got that, got those clothes up pretty, uh, you did something to them, that's for sure. We going back up, boy? Don't! If only we had those flashlights, you know what I'm saying? Then we could go out there. I don't want to listen to 20 minutes again of him, like, just think we were down there longer than I thought. Time flies when you're having fun. Is he gonna, or is he gonna say it's stressful? No! Yep, he's gonna, he's gonna do it again. It's not fun, it's stressful. Don't you see them? So, I'm not crazy then. Oh god, oh god. No, I think this is not this again. Come on, Chuck. You, you, you're better than this. Chuck, no, we don't gotta do this over again. Come on, Chuck. Is this gonna look for the eyeballs again? You! Oh god, no, no, Chuck. We don't need to do this. We don't gotta do this every single day. Crow? Out this late? Wait, that's different. He didn't he didn't say it last time. Has this like distracted him? Odd, very odd. Yeah, did we did we like break him out of the cycle? Well, did we fix his brain that's popping out? Well, I'm sure it's nothing. No, I I, I think we could I think we could go check ah, Chuck. Seems like he's having a better day than last time though. How silly of me to be afraid of the darkness. Did we break him? Like out of the cycle? It's our friend. Just the same as the day, no different. And I'm very, very tired. Oh god, is he gonna is he gonna do is he gonna leave again? Good night. Good night, Chuck. I had a very good time with you. Here, like, while while he's gone, I'm just gonna take, a, like, a couple tiny little peeks. I don't know if anything changes because he was here. So, uh, as you guys saw in the last video, the scarecrow is in here. I don't I don't know what the scarecrow is yet, though. Wait, it moved. Wait, it's right there. Wait, 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 wait. In the last video, it was, like, more near the lawnmower. Kind of, kind of odd. Kind of very odd. Eh. Wait, what's this? Is that per- Okay, no, that's a person. Okay, okay, okay. I thought that was, a. Uh, the guy looks kind of spooky, so I thought it was, a. Uh, thought it was a thing. I was very confused about Chuck Lloyd in the last video that we made about him, but I'm starting to learn a little bit more. I I feel like maybe next time it'll be a lot different. I feel like we, I don't know, maybe we broke him like out of the cycle. Cause like obviously, clearly he's stuck in like an endless loop of like the same thing. But I don't know, like it was different this time. It's very different. All right, so like the video if you want me to do this again. If I should uh, grow the courage to, to do it. So yeah, bye. Okay, I don't expect everyone to retain all the pieces of information I give you. I know, there have been a lot of scary videos lately on my channel. You know, keep it up with the Gazes, keep it up with the Chuck Lloyds, keeping up with the Kardashians. It's hard to do, but you know what? I'm sorry, I have to make it even more difficult because there are a lot more myths out there that aren't Gauz or not Chuck Lloyd. Also, we gotta do a little bit of catching up on Chuck Lloyd. So if you don't remember Chuck Lloyd, um, here's a little... Carlito! To, uh, sh tell them what Chuck Lloyd is. Apparently Chuck Lloyd, he's like a war veteran and he's like being haunted by these ghosts. And like some other things like uh, apparently he like lives in a constant loop of death or something and lives life as a, they, like there's a lot of like different stories I've heard. I need to check the laundry, but you're welcome to come with. Sure. I'd love to 
just check on the laundry with you in here. My gut tells me we should stay away from that. Oh, I want to go. I want to go near it, but I don't want to make him mad. All right. So this is his game right here that all those videos were shot at. One thing I didn't get to do is I didn't get to actually go inside the sewer or not the sewer. I didn't get to explore his basement. All right. So what we got to do is we got to click that right there and then the thing over there will open. All right, there we go. So we just go in here now. So yeah, obviously, since I was with Chuck Lloyd, I wasn't able to, you know, explore on my own. All right, so gotta say the code darkness incarnate. Okay, I should be able to, okay, I should be able to, I forget where the door is. Okay, okay, the door was right there. Okay, so I went through it. Gotta go grab me one of these flashlights. So I didn't get to do this before, so I'm actually like pretty nervous right now. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, uh, if only I could remember because uh, er, Carlito roll the roll the clip um, Chuck Lloyd He went over one of these hallways and told me not to follow him because he was gonna take care of some business Whatever that's supposed to mean. I'm sorry. Could you? Oh, yeah, I'm so sorry. Please do wait here Of course. Oh, I see somebody. I don't want to be followed right now. So I'm just trying to hide. Oh Oh, okay. I think I, I think okay. I found something. Oh God wait Wait, did you just got roll, roll tape back for a second? That something popped up behind me. Not sure what that was, but I found this. So he told me not to go near this. Boop! Well, that didn't do anything. Okay, a darkness and light. So that's a code for that door right there. Darkness incarnate for that one. And now we're here. I just randomly found this guy and he just kinda there's there's no known code for this. You have let me down, could could go 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 get new this. So apparently there's supposed to be a code for that as well. Only our god Chuck knows it. Yeah, yeah, our our god. I'm gonna get away from this guy now. So obviously there has to be something behind the door that's behind this door. That's behind this door behind this door. Like the three do four doors door doors <sighs> so uh one thing though so believe it or not um so there's a secret game that you're supposed to get to in this game game called shade light and apparently my editor carlito got to it we interviewed him on the spot uh dude help a who you said you got to a game called shade light how you do it the update can't do it anymore what it show you it was nothing it was definitely the shade light game but it was just a Big, a bit flat gray square. I tried looking some for a good 30 minutes, but I think it was just incomplete. The description said, this is where they all meet. I must have gotten in a point where they were still developing it and didn't expect someone would get there. Oh no. So yeah, I think they're still working on some big surprise or something. I don't know. So yeah, no nothing too new with uh, Chuck Lloyd. I just wanted to run around his basement a little bit. But... That sounds weird. <laughs> okay, so you remember that uh, that video I made about Gaz very, very recently? The one where I played this game? So he referenced some someone called Orinin. On the walls in uh, Gaz's place, it said Orinin is watching. So I I think I've played Orinin's place like a long time ago, but not in a, not in a, like, like I, I haven't even thought about this guy in a while. But he updated his place two days ago, so I'm, I might as well just, just see. Because I don't know if there's any story behind Orinin, but he's somehow in like the same realm as Gaz. I think that's like one of the vans in uh, Gaz's like, like a history too. Okay, so, hi. <laughs> that's not a person, okay. Boop! Didn't do anything. What? Oh god! Oh god, I didn't like that. Alright, so let me see what- Ew. Ew. Ew, it touched me. Oh, well, there she goes. Okay, oh, I am somewhere now. I didn't mean to do that, but I did. Sadness. Happiness. Ugh. I don't know if they're saying codes, uh, but- It's the circle of all emotions. Sadness. Happiness. Ugh. Oh, hey, I see arms. Touch! Cause every time we touch, I get this feeling And every time we kiss, I'm where I can fly Is that the only secret in the maze? Ooh. Well, that was a really good time I got to touch the love of my life's hands Are, <laughs> Are you okay, sir? Yeah, we all wondering the same thing I'm gonna touch it, wow Oh, he was not okay, he was never okay Oh, okay, happiness uh, opens this I think I have, oh, I have been here before, a long time ago. So you sit here, and then these people just stare at you. I'm finally the center of attention. But then you see clown heads here. So I th that's like how he relates to Gaz. Oh, wait, you just see that guy? He weaseled his way through here like a little weasel. Let me in. Oh. 
Okay, well that's is this are we watching TV? Let me let me take a go at it. Let me watch. Wow. This is just I'm gonna touch it. Oh, okay, so it, it did a thing, it took me somewhere. <laughs> ah! The tire swing fell. A tragic story. A sad Roblox story. Oh man, what happened? Happiness is the key to everything. I mean, whatever. This is stupid. What happened? To her arm? Excuse me, m'lady. You know what? I'm not gonna... Did she get really mad at her husband? Her cheating husband? And then she killed the trees? Alright, let me... Okay, I'm gonna go down here. What? Hey! They're not looking at me anymore. What is this? What does this mean, and why is it related to gauze? Why is, quote unquote, Oranin is watching? Why is that a thing? Hey, let me in, let me in here. Let me, let me. Ah! Oh my God, ew, you're disgusting. You should feel bad. All right, I'm just checking the walls to see if there's any other like little cracks like that. No, there's not. I have set up this romantic candlelit dinner for me and Shade Star. Shade Star, what do you have to say about this? No, please, no, 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 no. Thank you for staying with me through these hard times. So I don't know like the relation to Oranin and Gaz because this seems like a completely different world. And where are his legs? And where was that other girl's arm? Hey, whoop, boing, boing, boing. It's a punching bag. So I think I touched this thing to get to the maze, but I don't know if there's a maze in this game. And why were the girl's arms sticking through the bush in the maze game? I don't know if that's like a reference to this right now, but she has both of her arm. Well, she has an arm and a half here. Or was that his legs? Was that his legs sticking through? So I touched someone's smelly feet. God! So yeah, if anyone has information- Oh, wait, 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 wait! Oranin actually sent me a friend request. I completely forgot. So there, let me just- let me just strike up a conversation real quick. Hi. Uh, so I'll just let you know what happens with that later. Also, Eulifer, uh, do you remember this guy? Uh, he said, hello, sweet, sweet child. Which I am. I am very sweet. So good- so sweet, you gotta say it twice. Hello, Mr. Eulifer. Now we have something with that. Uh, not sure if I'm gonna- do too much of this. But yeah, if you don't remember who this guy is, he kills children and eats them, I think. Something like that. Something like Pennywise the Clown. I don't know if you've seen the It movies, but he's not a clown. Okay, so, uh, do a really quick clip of the Eulifer thing that we did last time. So we got into his game called Asylum. That's a, a clip here. Ooh. Cool. Oh. Oh! Oh, God! Oh. Oh, okay, that's interesting. Ew! Ew! But it wasn't finished. He didn't add, like, a roof. Like, I don't think anybody was meant to go there because only friends can access that one place. And as we know, Eulifer is a loser. Only three friends? So basically, I'm the only one who's able to access it. So this is the code for this door. Uh, la vie na lawyer. So it teleports you to this place. And then, yeah, see, even someone in the chat. To the left, there's something. Come. And then there's a dead end. Friends only. We need to add Eulifer. Yeah, yeah, it would be good if you had Eulifer. Try again like me. He likes me better. I'm Eulifer's friend. How? Because I'm hot. Step, step aside. I'm going to go explore. Okay, wait. I need to... You know, yeah, watch the video then, Buckarooski. Okay, so, as you can see... It's quite different than this was last time. Let me just blast the volume. So now we just gotta do a little. Oh! Oh god. Oh, this is so much scarier. Uh, alright, so we just gotta do a little bit of exploring. Oh god. Oh god, this is so much scarier. Oh. Is it moving? I can't tell. Uh, boop! Oh god! No, 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 no! Prying eyes where you should not roam. You no go no further into my home. Whatever. Hello, young man. Ah! Oh. I hear a baby. Hi. Long time no see. All right, so I think we have to go get the baby and tell him to shut up. Eulifer is a good man who does no harm to children. No crying aloud, idiot. No. Oh, oh, what are you doing? Hanging out, XD? Well, I can't read that. So I am literally the only person who's allowed to be here. I, he, he obviously added stuff to this. Okay! Is there a baby? Oh god! Oh, oh, oh god. Where's the baby? Oh, why is it? Is the baby a teddy bear? I don't like this. This is this makes me so uncomfortable. Is this a door? Nope, not a door. Uh, I hate this so much here. Boop! Jump, jump, jump! You gotta burp the baby. Boop, boop, boop! 
now we are out of here. All right, can we leave? Yes, we can. Time to go to go to bed. I just heard something. Ah, oh. I don't like this. It's like my least favorite thing right now. Oh, there's a door here. Okay, there she is. Hi. <laughs> Wait, maybe that alerted her that her baby needs to be taken care of. No, it didn't. I feel like whenever I come in here, it gets so much darker. Eh, okay. Wait, there's a note over here. Okay, it doesn't do anything. Okay, cool. Thanks, Yulifer. This is basically a more finished version. I don't know what he's trying to do with this game. It clearly... I don't know if I'm just missing something blatantly. It's a water fountain. Glug, glug, glug. Uh. Ah! Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> I completely forgot about this little girl. Ah! Oh, God. So, yeah, I'm not sure what he is going to do with this. And I'm not sure if he's going to let any of you see this game. Well, I mean, obviously, I'm going to let you see this game. But I don't know if he's going to let anybody else come to it. But I don't know. Because if we look at Ulifer, he's technically in the same universe as Chuck Lloyd. Because they're both friends with this guy. Who's apparently like the mastermind of it all. Like I previously, like this is the only one who does not want to accept my friend request. Well, these guys don't want to either, but you know, can you blame them? Yeah, if you don't remember, this guy is kind of, he's like the puppet master of all these guys and uh, uh, some other myths. Nobody really knows anything about this guy. I still, I'm just waiting on more to come out of this. Like, uh, I'm having more interactions with you for... I actually have not heard from Chuck Lloyd since the last video I made on him. Look, it's just, it's just our last conversation. It's just so sad. Yeah, it's actually a, a day since that last clip where I messaged Ulifer, and he still doesn't want to talk to me, so... Yeah, I, it's just, this is just kind of like a little update video. Yeah, there still really isn't much to Ulifer's games. Uh, Chuck Lloyd's still the same. Gauze is still Gauze. So yeah, let me know if you want me to keep doing these update videos on myths because like there's so much information to every single little thing. So sometimes I gotta fit in one of these videos to just keep you guys up to date on uh, all the little details. Yeah, keep exploring. Keep just letting me know if you guys see anything that I miss. Like at Chuck Lloyd's place, I think we found everything so far. Gaz's place. I still have not explored this place on my own. I still gotta do that, but, uh, because last time I was here, Gaz took me on a tour, and I couldn't really break free from him, so, yeah. Just let me know if, if, if anything out, out there is a little spooky. Thank you. Apparently, Chuck Lloyd, he's like a war veteran, and he's like being haunted by these ghosts. And like some other things, like uh, apparently he like lives in a constant loop of death or something, and lives life as a, like there's a lot of like different stories I've heard. Have you ever woken up in the middle of the night? Yes, I have. And seen something hiding in the dark part of your room? That's them! Oh god, this is not good. He said he told all of us to not go in the dark. The darkness, I see something. You! When I was here last, I did not see those. I swear, I did not see those. That's like, that's actually. I don't like this. I'm very uncomfortable. One thing's for sure. This doesn't lead to the laundry. <laughs> yes. Ah. My gut tells me we should stay away from that. Oh, I want to go. I want to go near it, but I don't want to make him mad. So uh, about almost half an hour ago, be here in 30 minutes. It's very rude to be late. It has been five. I just checked. It's been five months almost since I've last interacted with Chuck Lloyd, like in a game. My last video on him was five months ago. And now I'm about to be late and make him very angry. <laughs> so it looks like he, I haven't joined his, his game was open yesterday, but I did, I didn't go in. I just wanted to get, you know, the grand exclusive tour from Chuck himself, but he updated this picture. So it looks like it's completely remodeled and everything. So I guess I should just join right now. So already a bunch of people already followed him here. <laughs> And they're probably all just like stomping on his grass and like making him angry. All right, good join now. It's uh, it's almost been 30 minutes. I I I'm two minutes early. Hopefully he doesn't get mad at me. I'm so excited. It's been so long. Dude, idiot. What are you doing? All right, I'm going to wait until a very exact minute. I still have about, uh, how many seconds do I have left? I have 30, 20, 28 seconds before it is time to enter his home. Okay, he ke he just keeps spamming. Bad manners make for bad guests. Should I just... All right, I'm gonna I'm I'm pull up on the boy real quick. I don't even care if I'm 20 seconds. Guys, back! You idiots! Oh my god, he keeps spamming. He's getting really angry at everyone. Knock, knock. I don't see him, like, through the window or anything. Why is that? Dude, literally all these people... I was kicked from the game. Why would he kick me? He did this last time. 
Dude, he, you invited me. I'm a here, idiot. Oh, he kicked everybody. I guess I guess it wasn't a personal attack then. Chuck, I'm here for the tea party or a uh, housewarming party. Tea party sounds like a like a like little girl thing. I don't know if Chuck Lloyd wants me to phrase it that way. Sandra doesn't allow for guests so late in the night. Oh yeah, Sandra is his quote unquote wife, dead wife. Uh, pretty much like the person who, the person in his head, really. So he invites me over and is like, not, nah, you, you can't really work out. The wife is saying, no, coming knocking on our door so late, it's bad manners. But what am I supposed to do? We went, last time I visited him, it was the same exact thing. Oh, he turned the light on. Oh, I just, he just opened the blinds. He just opened the curtains and closed them. Oh, I, I want to go in the house so bad. Oh, I see him right there. He keeps spamming it. This person's going to get kicked. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> the door just opened. Hi. Hello, Chuck. E-wave. You guys hear? The Looks like the sun's coming up. Oh, so now we can go in. Oh, wait. Probably something crazy happens at night. Because uh, last time, we was roll back the tape. He started seeing these things. And they actually were appearing in the game. These shadow creatures. The old music. Oh, my God. I wonder if we're going to be like be able to see the shadow creatures here. Because we got to see them last time. And they would just uh, disappear as soon as we would go near them. Oh, yeah. Also, uh, last night, I took the screenshot of... Chuck Lloyd and Claw's Aconite in the in their gate in the the Lloyd residence together. Appar uh, apparently, Claw's Aconite he kind of hinted at that he's the one that like messed Chuck Lloyd up because he told me you don't want to end up like Chuck Lloyd, do you? Or something like that. Oh my God, I'm legit like really scared right now. Come in, okay? Nobody else. Nobody else. No hey, hey, hey! <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Oh, I missed him so much, but at the same time, I'm so nervous. I'm not sure if I should, like, go in the kitchen or not, because he's very particular on what I can and can't do. Please sit. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll... I'll sit right here. Can I get you something? Okay, go gonna do the same thing as last time. Tea, please. <laughs> There's people in the window. Why is he just staring at me? I, I said T. All right, I said it again. T, please. Oh, <laughs> he's just staring at me. For a second, I thought you were giving me the silent treatment. No, I said, that's very rude. All right, Buster. Huh, looks like we need to go shopping. Do you not have tea? Well, while the tea's cooking, let me show you around. All right, show me around, Buster. It's been a very long time. Huh? What What do you mean? What do you, hey, oh, hello there. What, are you he, he was looking at me. Bad manners make for bad guess, bad manners make for bad guess, bad, bad, and he's gone. All right, where are you taking me? Oh. He's got his own office now. This is my office. Very nice, Chuck Lloyd. It's where I type up all sorts of important things. What's that? A love story. Bad manners make for bad... Oh my god. <laughs> so weird. Where is he? Where'd he go? Ah. Still have the same bed, I see. Yeah, that's good. Ew. Look at that. This, this, this viewer has been following me around for like two years now. And has not changed it. Oh, there it goes. It's very rude to keep... He closed the blinds on them. <laughs> it's very rude to be peeping. Ah, the lights. Oh my god, it all works. Chuck Lloyd is fed up with all this. Where I do my other business, I see. He has the same painting like three times throughout the house. What does it mean? See, right there too. Right there and there. So maybe... Then of course, the kitchen. This is great, Chuck. You've done a really good job. Now sit back down! I insist. Okay, Buster. All right. <laughs> I, I want to so badly go, like, open up all of these, open up all of these, dig in the trash a little bit, see what I can find. No tea today. That was the last of it. Wow. Thank, thanks, thanks, buddy. I can always count on you. We going out there with that thing? Oh, Lord. Yup. The floodgates have opened. Hi, Tempest. Where, where, <laughs> where are we going now? Get off my property! I'm in an... Okay, time to just ban everyone. Oh. That's actually much, much better. Oh, I was literally just about to type that and he, okay, let me, what does he do to afford like a, uh, such a big house on such a big piece of land? It's like the same exact format of his old house, except way bigger and like a lot more detailed. Garden, garden is coming in nicely. I see that. There's probably some hidden thing here, but I'm not gonna, I'm, I can't, I can't look. I'll look after this conversation, but I can't now. This one is taking its time though. This is probably like buried under like some dead human person thing. Are they, do these open? Huh. Oh God, is it locked just like last time? What's in here? I must have lost the key. What's in there? There's gotta, cause in the last one there was like a ghost person. 
Well, maybe tomorrow. No, you didn't. You didn't lose the key. <laughs> <laughs> that again. Bad manners make for bad guests. We are really close right now. Should I back up? Yeah, I will. He's gonna get mad at me if I don't. What do you think of the remodeling? There's so much space. I'm really happy for you, Chuck. Yeah, it's, it's great. I'm eating a pretzel. I hate this this face that he has. You know, Sandra really doesn't like me having people over past nightfall. But I think you should stay. We're having a sleepover? That'd be great! We're having a sleepover! <laughs> I'm gonna say a sleepover. <laughs> That's gonna make him mad. All right, just try not to wake her up. I'll, I'll try. Bad manners make for bad guests. Bad manners, bad manners, bad- Look at this guy's hairline. I, I never got like a really close look. We're locked in for the night. Oh, all safe and set. Yeah, all safe from the shadow people that you see. But I won't say that because that might be rude. What are you gonna do? You want me to go in there and clean it or something? Oh, oh my God. Hey, what? Water waster. Why are you looking at me? Ah, uh, he's gonna. Oh, he's still looking at me. She's gonna break eye contact for a bit. You know, look around. <laughs> it's very rude to stare. Yep. No, I, I'm sorry. Ah. Uh, oh god. Oh! Oh! oh my god. What is he doing? Hands are stuck on midnight. That's gotta mean something. That's got. That's gotta mean something. I don't like. I really want to like just start flickering the lights and testing everything out. I'm gonna sit a couple seats over from him just to not be weird. Hands are stuck. I'm gonna, I should really get this fixed. There's something to do with the time. With like, I love this show. Uh, yeah, yeah, me. Just to not be weird. Me, me too. Well, he locked the server, so it can only be me and him now. Do you watch this show often? <laughs> Occasionally. I hope he doesn't start asking me questions about it. Oh, oh, okay. There. Much better. Yeah, much better, buddy. That's great. You're great. Uh, <laughs> all right. All right, Chuck. Sandra really doesn't like this show. Sandra also probably doesn't like how close we are right now. Wouldn't even let our daughter watch? They have a daughter? I'm gonna ask him about that. How old is your daughter? Do you know? What if his head just starts spinning right now? <laughs> I didn't know they had a daughter. Like, that was never a thing. He's not talking to me. Chuck, Chuck, are you right? Chuck, she would be 13 now if she were still alive. Oh, well, I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Chuck. I didn't, I didn't know that. I didn't know about any of that. Chuck, we've been... Oh, okay, thank you. Where, where, we, where, where are we going? Excuse me. He's going to the bathroom. I think he's going to the bathroom. Let me just get up for a second. Oh, okay, that's the bathroom. Wait, why is that open? Okay, okay, gotta get back, gotta get back, gotta get back, gotta get back. What's in here? Is there anything I can search? Is there any... Think I can search. Okay, he's coming back. I didn't move. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't move. Did you get up? Yes, my leg was getting sore. Sorry, muscle pains and stuff. Well, don't do that. All right, I'll be. I'll be right over here. I know he's not in the bathroom yet. I, I know. I know you're waiting for me. He's waiting for me to mess up. <laughs> ding ding ding. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm just flickering the lights. Hey. You back to watch? Oh, yeah, sitting right next to me. I'm having a good time. I love company. I can't wait till night comes. You're a great host. And I mean that, Chuck. Thank you. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I hate this. Why is there so many crows? Let me make us something. All right. Now, how do I get out of here? Silly me. I keep forgetting we have no food. The way this fridge is stocked, you never think we think we never eat. Well, that, that's okay. I'm not that hungry. I got a big belly. You look hungry. I don't know how to respond to that. Is that a fat joke? I could run to the store. Uh, what store? Is there a store near nearby? You're gonna feed me dead people? Oh, uh, hi. Sure. Th that doesn't really, that wasn't really an answer. It was like a yes or no thing. Don't move a single hair. Oh God, I hate that door. I hate that. Oh, uh, hi. What? Did you forget something? Oh, and don't go snooping around either. Sa Sandra hates it. All right, where is he? Oh, God, he's still right there. All right, I'll see how far away he gets, and then I'll... Is he just going into the hay? All right, when I see him go around... Okay, I see him. Okay, there's no way he can get here that fast. Okay, gotta make sure I don't mess around with anything. Okay, this... I hear him coming back. I love this, the curtain open. I love the curtain open. I, I, I can't go back and change that. It's already been done. It's already been done. Okay, he, I see him. He's coming back. Or, or is he going? He's going that way. Let me just close those so we can't see through there. No, he's somewhere around here. Oh, I hate this. I, I hear him. 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 Ah! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Did he... Did he see it? Oh, he sees that. That's close. 
Who closed those curtains? Uh, I did earlier. Th there was sun in my eyes. There was sun in there. You know, in my eyes. You don't really have eyes, so you don't know. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I thought it was her again. Oh, I can just blame everything on her. Good, great. It's getting dark after all. Unfortunately, everyone at the store was dead. Is that a... No food today, it seems. Oh, whoa. I thought that was going to be a joke. Oh. Wait, so we went over there. Can I... I'm going to get up. Oh. Was I not supposed to? Okay, I'll go back. I'll go back then. Okay, that, that satisfied him. What does he mean everyone at the store was dead? Isn't he supposed to be, like, dead too? What is that? What what in the world is that red dot? That's gotta be like a TV, right? Well, it's almost dark, so uh, bedtime. We should get some. Yeah, we we, sh we should get some rest. You can take the the couch. I've been on the. All right, I've been on the couch for a while now. Wait, I got this. May I use the bathroom, please? I gotta go to the bathroom. And sure. Oh, that's his alarm. All right, no peeping. Uh, all right. So okay, wait. Did he open? Oh no, no wait. All right, no, it actually makes pee. That's, that's, uh, that's a little too much, Chuck Lord. All right, I flushed it. I gotta go wash my hands. He's right there. He's, he's being really respectful. <laughs> God, I hate this so much. All right, scrub it up, dub in my tub. Oh, I see him. Okay, hello, Chuck. Oh, my God. A nice, healthy bowel movement by yours truly. All done? Yes, Chuck. Good. If you have to go again, hold it. <laughs> what will do? Pretend like your life depends. I don't like how we said that. Will my life actually depend? Ooh, what? When it gets dark in here, what happens? Good night. Good night, Chuck Lloyd. Something I thought I would never say. I can't tell if he's like out there looking at me. Here, I I can hear footsteps pretty well. So I'm gonna just like I'm gonna jump and see what happens. Hello, my love. Oh, me? Oh my god, he's talking to Sandra. Maybe if he's talking to her, I won't like waking up just now, are you? Okay, what can where can I go snoop? I wish this was like a live stream so I could like ask you guys where I should go snoop. Such a late hour. Oh, I wish my footsteps didn't make any noise. Oh my god. Oh my I gotta go back. I gotta go back. This I don't know where to go. No, no, he's fine. Oh, they're talking about me. What if somebody named Sandra actually joins the game? I would start peeing in, in my on my desk and then my computer would catch on fire and then I would die and never be able to tell the tale to you guys. I told them no snooping around. Oh, I'm not, I'm not let me just, I'm, I'm listening in for footsteps. I'm assuming he's doing the same for me though. Oh, yep, I heard him. I hear him. I'm glad you're in a good mood then. Uh-huh. Alright, so while he's talking to Sandra, what could I do to like distract him? I wish the server wasn't locked so one of you could like throw a rock through his window and then he'd go over there and I could I could make a break for it in the kitchen or something. <gasps> oh, oh wait, I didn't I didn't really mean to click that. I wasn't thinking, I wasn't thinking, I wasn't thinking. Good night. Okay, so he's actually going to bed now. So I think that means I can like run around. Okay, just kinda <gasps> I hear him walking, I hear him walking. Okay, there is no way I am getting up again. I, I, I try to do it for you idiots. Uh, and then, look, I know I was getting caught and saying I was too scared. I did it, I got up, I went to the kitchen, I heard his footsteps. Like, I, I know he's awake right now, because I keep hearing, I, I heard like a tiny little footstep. There's no way he's not awake. Should I go sneak into his room? <gasps> okay, I saw his name, I saw his name, right there. That's what he's, so he's in bed right now. Should I try to open the door? <gasps> What's that? I see it! Is that? Ah! Oh my God! Is that? That's the shadow people. Ah! Oh wait, I forgot. I I got I gotta stay asleep. Why is it sitting on that chair? I want to get it. Can I open this? Wait, why? Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! I see one right there though. I literally see one right there. Oh my God! He just look. It's still there, and it's right there too. What did I say about snooping around at this hour? I I had restless leg. If you don't know what that is, it, it it's like when your leg starts having like a spasm in your sleep, and you have to like walk around, or you won't be able to fall asleep. I have it all, every single night. Well, you could have been hurt. You're lucky they don't come in the living room. I'm guessing he means those guys. You what? Uh, nothing. Where? Uh. <laughs> Chuck, it, it must have been a dream. Hear me out on this one. Where did you see it? Uh, oh, kitchen. Okay, I saw it in the kitchen. Then let's check. Well, I don't see anything anymore. Nothing, see? Thanks, I, I, was, I was scared, Chuck. Thank you for that. Now go to sleep and stop snooping. Oh, man, that was... That, for some reason, that was so scary when he started... Oh my god. Oh my god, it's back. Is, is he gonna start freaking out? Dude, how do you not see that one? Oh, sorry. Okay, I'll get I'll get back in the couch. You know, you can take the bed since you're the <gasps> Ah 
Okay. Thank you. You just gonna so you gonna uh, oh all right I'll be uh I'll be over here. Ew, it's literally right. Oh my god, they're all in his. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I can't see. I can't. Ew, his closet. Okay, I see where the bed is now. I see. You just gonna stare at me? Oh my god. Oh, literally like. Try not to try not to turn the lights on. All it does is aggravate them. Oh, all right. Literally, uh, like I'm not trying to freak you guys out, but imagine that in your closet. I didn't wait. I didn't touch the lights. Everything that I heard it. Oh, ah, okay. Oh, nothing to be seen here. Ew, it's in the bathroom. Oh my god. Okay, it's gone. It's gone. Oh my god. Imagine seeing this type of stuff in real life. There's a little nightlight for you. Thanks, Chuck. Imagine. Oh my god. I'm actually not gonna be able to sleep tonight thinking about that. I'm literally going. I'm literally home alone tonight as well. So that also sucks. Alright, there he. Oh. Oh, I I'm going in his closet. I don't care. See, I can go in his closet because, like, oh my god. God, I hate that so much. I hate that. See, I could just run on the bed real quick so I can kind of like snoop around a bit. I, I just can't go in the bathroom. And I don't, looking at that, I don't really wanna. So that works out for me. There's like nothing I can open over here though. That's an issue. <gasps> okay, he's up, he's up, he's up. Are you doing all right? Yes, very cozy, Chuck. Very cozy. Were you in the closet? No, I wasn't. I, I wasn't in there, buddy. Good. I don't know why you would do such a thing. I, I, <coughs> it's very dangerous. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. That got me. That, okay. The, the, when, when you're in bed, you don't see that one. But now I learned that. I wonder if this is the side that Chuck sleeps on. And if what I'm smelling right now is Chuck's deodorant. Oh my. Where'd he go? I just saw a leap and I, I don't see a thing anymore. Oh. Oh, he's leaving. I heard the door. Oh, he's closing it. Oh my god. Okay, shadow person there. Oh my god. Oh my god. That that got me real bad. I didn't like that. Did not like that. I'm gonna stay in bed now. I can't find anything. Like and the other one, he had a he had a basement. So it's almost uh morning time again. Like it's about to be bright out. I don't know where he is. Alright, so it's about to be six. Okay, so the shadow people disappear at 6 a.m. Let's remember that. You All you guys are going to be able to visit this place, so you got to remember that. 6 a.m., you won't see the shadow people. So that's what... I don't know when the shadow people start, though. I can't remember. Maybe 12. Maybe 12 they, they start. I'm going to turn the lights on because I'm awake now. going to turn them off now because I hear Chuck. Okay, and the music starts at... 619. Oh, hi, Chuck. Good morning. Good morning! And you're okay? Uh, well rested. Yes. No scratches? Nothing of. Nope. Great! Need to get some yard work done. Didn't sleep much last night. Did he forget the key again? I, I don't know. So yeah, this is Chuck reliving the same day over and over again. Silly me, I forgot I lost the key. Oh, I see. So when he got up, when he let me in at the morning time yesterday now, the first thing he did was go over there and say he forgot the key. So that's happening again now. Him reliving the same day every single day. Don't come in. Okay. Okay, I'm zoomed in. Where is he? I hear something. I think that's in his closet. Where is that? In his closet? Yep, 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 yep. In his closet. In his closet. So it was on the right side of his closet. He found the key! The key! Alright, so if we want to actually find it, you got to go to the right side of his closet, maybe? Because that's where he was when I heard the noise, so... Well, for me, I need to go talk to Sandra. Please get started on the lawn. <laughs> Will do, Chuck. And if you see any pesky crows, like all the paintings, all the paintings in his, in his house are all crows, bash, bash it with the shovel. Oh my god! Oh! I hate that! Where is he? Okay, he's, he's going out there. He's... Oh my god, I'm gonna see him in the kitchen. I'm oh, hello there, Chuck. Alright, I'm gonna... Oh! <laughs> and they're opened! He's still looking at me. Alright, so which one do I take? Shovel. Is there anything else I can take in here? Oh, I can't drive this. This is actually something you're supposed to be able to drive. What could be in the cooler, I wonder? I don't know, I'll, I'll get started on, on the lawn, on the bro. It just closed! It just closed! Okay! Wait, so do I have to dig up some, uh, something? He said he has to talk to Sandra. Oh, all right, there, that, that's closed now. I wonder if it's in here. Do I have to do some of the scarecrow? All right, th does it look fine or is there a certain part that needs more work? What part needs more work? No, it's all wrong! The crows have been ruining the garden. They've been doing that 
since five months ago, the last video. You gotta get them. They always peck, peck, peck at everything. Don't follow me. It's very rude. Pesky crows. He said that exact same thing in the other video I made. Ah! He stubbed his toe, apparently. Oh, I see a crow. I see a crow. Got hit with a shovel. All right. Th sorry, this is what Chuck wanted. Oh, what's happening? <laughs> what? What? What am I digging up? Am I digging something up or something? Oh my god. I have the basement key now. Okay, so, yep, did that. Uh, where is the basement, though? Where? I, I have no idea where the basement is. Hello again. Oh, hello. I got those pesky crows for you. Did you? I, bur I buried him in everything. Now, where is your basement? You go ahead and watch some telly. I'll check it. All right. Now, where was that basement? <gasps> I see it. Should I go in? It's locked. I'll need a key. Oh, God. That's not the basement. That's the attic. Go back. Go back. Go back. Oh, is that the basement? Oh, that's the basement. That's the basement. I'm going in. I don't care. I'm going in. I'm go. <laughs> I'm in. Well, I guess I got this to explore now. Oh, God. Chuck's gonna be so mad at me. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. He did not like that. He is really upset right now. He keeps sending me this. All right. Chuck is a normal person. Chuck goes to work every day. Chuck enjoys nice walks in the park. Chuck feeds birds when they are hungry. Chuck watches the telly when bored. Chuck is a normal person. That is how Chuck Lloyd would describe himself. I think Adam will actually have a better explanation of who Chuck Lloyd is. So let me play that real quick and then I will explain a little bit more about Chuck Lloyd and the people who surround him. Hello, Speedy here. So, Chuck Lloyd is a presumably dead old man. He frequently talks to his deceased wife Sandra and gets haunted by some form of shadow creatures during the nighttime. Whilst he is asleep, he relives the day of which he died, and the longer he stays awake, the more insane he gets. His house was built on top of a temple named Shadelight. The Shadelight basement contains a big maze containing five statues. Each statue requires a unique phrase to activate. Once all five phrases are known, the door to Shadelight will open. So far, we only have two phrases. Back to the video! So if you look through Chuck Lloyd's friends, you'll see me and a few other people, and then you'll see Goldity. Not much is known about Goldity. Everybody does know that Goldity is kind of the, the puppet master behind these five people. Chuck Lloyd, Father Grimm, Masquerades, Taroa, and Ulifer. Goldity I've known about for a very long time, maybe a year, two years, and I've just received barely any information about him. I don't think anyone's really met him in game. There's just not much. But he is definitely the puppet master behind Chuck Lloyd and all the others. What we do know is that he wants something to do with shade light and he wants um, some information that hide behind those gates that Adam showed you. I hope that was enough explaining. Um, it's all very vague and confusing. Now back to the normal video. Chuck Lloyd, almost time for tea, don't be late, because bad manners make for bad guests. And as you can see, he's in his game right now. It's about the time he wanted to meet with me, 7 p.m. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get in the server. Okay, there's a few slots. <laughs> it's been so long. Wait, I'm still paying for a VIP server? No, get out of here. Thousand Robux a month, are you joking? Okay, whatever, I'll do that later. I'll probably forget, and it's full. All right, it's been maybe like five minutes, and I'm finally in here. Chuck, where is he? Of course, he's just spamming bad manners make for I why, why was I kicked? It took me like five minutes to get in here. Ah, oh, look at me. I'm Chuck. I even told him it seems like there's a lot of traffic. Whatever. He always like treats me terribly and then lets me in and then treats me terribly. While I was waiting, I stress ate like 10 nuggets and now I'm really, really full. Chuck? Hey, Chuck. Old pal. No! He's having like an extra bad day today. <laughs> look at him. Why was I kicked again? All right, give me another second. Hey, Chuck, look, it's me. Hey, Chuck, uh, may, may I come in? Oh, okay, looks like I'm allowed in. Uh-oh, literally like 50 people just instantly joined. Stop bothering me! Shoo! Ah! Okay, cool. Long time no see. <laughs> He's so intimidating. I didn't say, okay, I'm so... That's very bad manners. We scheduled for... Whatever. 
Hello. <laughs> hey, Chuck. Come inside while we wait. Sure thing. Could we get rid of that disgusting creature? The slow, creaky opening. I'm trying to figure out if anything's different from last time. Sit! Okay, sorry. I wonder if this... Okay. All right, this still works as normal. So if he turns on the lights, I'll be able to hear... So many of them! Gah! Oh, hey, Chuck. Never really give much personal space, huh? Hello. How have you been? Good! Great. I had quite the long nap. Yeah, it's been like six months. I feel much better now. You really weren't doing so good last time I saw you. <laughs> Are you bringing the man from the grocery? Oh, does he mean Adam? Uh, if you're talking about Adam, I, I came alone. I suppose we have plenty of guests already. You see, he did say he's bringing a guest. I asked like my friends, like, did he secretly invite you? Plus the others in the basement. Say psych right now. <laughs> is my water run? Oh, my oh, it is. I hear it. I'm sorry, Chuck. I didn't do it, though. <laughs> I pay a fortune on the bill already. I really, really want to get into the basement. Like, I really, really want to. It's always these long, awkward pauses with him. We cut silences out, but it's been like a minute of just sitting here. Just watching his show. Yeah, Chuck? What? What? He just been, he hasn't been said anything in like two or three minutes. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. That scared me so bad. Oh my god. Hey, hey Chuck. Have you been on the show lately? Oh, he's talking about the Taroa show. Oh, uh, Taroa is another one just like him that I literally have never met, but I really want to. This fellow looks just like you. Yeah. Kinda. His name's Albert, too. Is it? Must be just a coincidence. Let's go. Sure thing, man. I'm sure our guest is already angry. Oh, we're going straight to the basement. No. All right. There we go. Guess, okay, we're just going straight into the basement. Oh my god, yes. But I'm scared. <gasps> Goldeny. Oh my god. Nobody has ever... Uh, as far as I'm concerned, like, literally nobody has met Goldeny before. I... I didn't think he was coming. I genuinely... That makes this so much creepier. He should be somewhere inside. Let's go. Okay. Oh, my heart like skipped a beat when I saw that name. It's been like over a year of just like wondering anything about this guy. Because he doesn't accept friend requests. Only has like his minions or whatever. Like the people he controls on here. Dark Nets and Croquet. I'll do it for you. Oh, look, I got it. Darkness incarnate. Thank you. Oh my god, man. So Adam actually made a whole map of this entire place. I always forget the darn thing. I'm always here to help, man. God, the Oh my god. He Use Adam's map. He literally spent like hours doing it. Chuck. I literally am in complete disbelief that Goldity is here. That that literally changes the entire scope of what I was expecting for this video. Oh, you going the wrong way again? What? Huh. What? That's different. What's different? I l I have no idea what Goldity would want to do with me, to be honest. I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. What? Not well. I wasn't even worried before. I wouldn't have noticed. This is assumed to be like his. Oh wait, this is his wife, huh? I I forget what happened, but I'm pretty sure that's like his dead wife right there. Oh, are you about to talk to her? God, this music, man. <laughs> God! Why are we looking at these? I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure. Caught my eye. No need to be nosy. That's a man's wife. There's something special. What? I can't really read it. The candle. Oh. Oh, wait. You can turn it off and on. Like, you could light it and unlight it. That probably means something. I don't even have to light them. Someone does it for me. Keep that in mind for when you guys explore this area. I always found it odd, but it helps me see. What does he mean? Was it this way? No. This way. Good job. God. Oh, oh my god. I think we found it. There he is. There's our guest. Oh my god. I've been waiting for you. Go on. Me first. Go in. Okay. Oh, this music's different. Goldity? Hello? Oh my god. I'm, I'm really nervous right now. Hello? Oh, not this again. I don't believe we've formally met yet. No, we haven't. I am Goldity. I am Albert. Nice to meet you. I've heard some things about you. God. <sighs> you were helping others. Those who want to get through these doors. Yeah, was that a bad thing? Tell me, Albert. Do you know what's on the other side? No, I, I don't, actually. Sandra, not now. Our guests are speaking. Okay, he just ran away. Typical. Is Chuck, like, scared to approach Goldity? I would assume so. He, like, moved away to, like, push away Sandra or something. It's far dangerous. More dangerous than you could ever imagine. He won't even face me. And I need to get into it all for one reason and one reason alone. 
Why? I, I don't even want to ask why. But I'm not going to tell you quite yet. I'm not one to spoil. But you should know. <laughs> oh, God. That it's best in my hands alone. I need your help, Albert, just as much as anyone else. With what? You're Goldity. I'm Albert. What could I do for you? He has good manners. He will help us. Shut up, Chuck. I have three keys to the door. However, one of them has changed. I see that. Three of them. Wait, what do you mean one of them has changed? So wait, two of the keys, I think lie in the hands of like the myth community so he has the other three it's not impossible but it's not common either the keys have changed many times over the thousands of years they've existed both the keys and the people are connected with each other the five keys meaning obviously these five people right here would i have to get all of them here but eulifer's key has changed i haven't been able to find out much more about it i told you we couldn't trust along those one thanks chuck don't know why you're over there still he hid himself in, in his asylum no one knows of a way inside per se except for grim father grim something in his library is hidden so it's like in order to get into asylum we have to get into the library which we probably don't know how to get into either trust me and i will trust you grim's library has lots of stuff inside it that could help find the way in and tell me of it why would i tell you though what do i get out of this it's like i want to negotiate and like ask questions but i'm just like this is such a rare opportunity because I, in like the two one or two years of me knowing about this or like one and a half years of me knowing about chuck lloyd and gold i've never gotten to meet him i, I want to negotiate i'm just gonna say it oh wait okay he's talking okay say by the bell when he lets people into his home i don't know when but the information he has is best given to me not to the hunters trying to find it with that he's pretty much referring to this whole entire group right here you're going to do just that tell me a way in understood i just i i don't want to say no Okay, I I'm negotiating time. He said, good. And I said, if I help you, <laughs> am I allowed to go in with you? I feel like that's like literally the most fair thing. Obviously, I'm not supposed to help him though, because it's like, it's the myth hunters versus him versus five of his disciples. Chuck, Taroa, Masquerades, Father Grimm, uh, Eulifer. Oh, he's coming in. He's not responding to my question. Oh God, what's happening? We'll see if you last. What? What do you mean? It doesn't answer my question. Any more questions you have, ask of Chuck or me when you return. Chuck will help you. Chuck is literally completely useless. Don't fail me. I will not. Oh dear. Oh dear. I just I, I just agreed to something. Great. Oh man, he just left. Hey Chuck. Did you hear that? Yes, Chuck, I did. We get to go looking for the books. Yes, Chuck, we do. We do, Chuck. That's good. I like to think of us as friends already. <laughs> yeah, now we get to be best friends. Well, my shelves are looking a little empty. Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna find the book in here, man. Oh, he was just staring at it and I turned it off and it, it like snapped him out of it. I'm sorry. Are you crazy? What are you doing? Oh my God, I'm sorry. We are not best friends. Don't touch the candles. If they all go out, I don't think we'll be able to come down here ever again. What does that mean? I'm sorry I yelled. I forgive you, Chuck. I'm used to it. Well, here's Eulifer's, but the code changed, so we can't even bother with that. Anchor. Anger. You almost got it, Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> he just goes in as if he did it himself. Okay, so you have to type something into here, but I don't remember it and it changed apparently. This is the one we need to look for, but no one knows how to get into the asylum yet. So we need to get to father's house. He has a big library, just like the boss said. Lots of books there, much more than I have. Should be something in there about it. Now? Oh God, the whispering is getting really intense. I don't think Chuck Lloyd can leave his house, like, or at least go far from it. So I don't know what he thinks he's gonna do. What do you mean, but, uh, between you and me? Father's a bit of a hermit. I think that means, like, he doesn't leave his house. He just isolates himself. He stays in his house alone all day and reads. No telling when we'll be able to get him to open his house to us, but it shouldn't be too long now. When that happens, he got real close for that. I will send you a letter. No, that could take a long time. And we will go there together? Chuck leaving his house? Just because it's another house does not mean you can throw manners out the window. <laughs> of course. So behave. It'll be nice to get you out of the house too, Chuck. Yes, I, I get out of the house plenty, I, I think. So what now, Chuck? I go do the garden. You do? I shop. Oh God, no. He's saying his tagline. Oh, I, I, th I thought he was saying this right here. Chuck is a normal person. Chuck feeds birds when they're hungry. Chuck watches the telly when bored. Chuck is a normal person. Uh-oh. Chuck, where'd you go? Why are you lagging behind? I'm overweight. There's no other explanation, Chuck. Look at my character. You know, this is still my basement, and you shouldn't go anywhere without me. It's very bad manners. What's this? 
that's something new. That note being there is something new, but I can't step away from him. He won't let me. Another one. What do these mean? I know he's indirectly trying to show me them. I forgot about this room. Those notes, though. Obviously, I'll, I'll need you guys to just kind of go through every square inch of this place. I'll even include the map that Adam made in the description. Just so you guys can navigate the whole entire place, like, a lot easier than you normally would. Did you just look at it again? No, no, of course not. Uh, no. You know, Chuck is taking quite the long time to get back to the start, wherever the start is. Oh, well, there's there was his door. All right, and up we go. Look, he got it, Darkness Incarnate. He got it right this time. Good for him. Well, what are you waiting for? I'm just going to be tidying up. It was nice seeing you again, Chuck, as always. You don't always have to follow me, you know. All right, say bye. Say goodnight back. Have a good day. We'll speak soon. Well, guys, I think you guys know what to do. Um, his, The link will be in the description. I literally will need everybody to investigate. And also, I'm not sure if there will be many clues yet, for Father Grimm. Well, also, nobody can visit his house yet. But I hope this wasn't too confusing, and I hope everybody can go and find something that hasn't been found before, because this is the perfect opportunity. Like, what happens when all the candles go off? What do all those notes mean? There's a lot that you guys actually have to figure out that I won't be able to. So I'll be checking the comments. The more people we can get just investigating this and just kind of looking around. And if any comment, like, in the in the comments has, like, helpful information or, like, a really good theory, make sure to thumbs it up. Don't just re repost what they say. Like, make sure to thumbs up their comment just so, like, all of us can see it, you know? Only informative comments in the comment section today. Yeah, we have a lot of investigation on our hands. Um, I'm really excited. Oh, he's right behind me. So... <laughs> Oh, what? So, if you didn't watch the last episode, what are you doing down here? I thought this was a different bathroom. Oh, boy, was I wrong. You sure were! So, in the last one, I had a very long meeting with Chuck that I just got out of. And I found my way into his basement. And it's, uh... He messaged me, bad manners make for bad guests, about a million times. I think you should leave. Uh, do you need help with laundry? Right there? No! Bad mirrors big for bad guys. Bad okay, I'm go. I'm going up. I'm going up. So the flashlight has a battery now. I can't get out. Oh, there we go. He helped me out a little bit there. Oh, oh my God, guys! <laughs> oh my God! So I'm gonna have to get the key from from the closet. I'm gonna have to get the shovel. I'm gonna have to kill the crow, and then I'm gonna go get in the basement. Okay, so, uh, last time, I I'm currently at, uh, last time I was at Chuck Lloyd's place, uh, we left it off on a pretty big cliffhanger. So, I, I you, you guys already saw, but I went in the basement, he caught me, he got really mad, and then kicked me. It's about, like, a week later now, and, um, hmm. and I actually have not been, like, exploring the Oh my, I hate, I hate the shadow people so much. Let me just, hey, hey, scram. Ugh, I hate, I hate that. And you guys can't, here, give me a sec. All right, so a, a lot of you, like, this place has gotten, like, over 100,000 visits since the last, uh, video. So you guys probably know a lot more than me right now. But to get the first key to get in the shed, you gotta go over here. There's some, okay, okay, so the key... Well, zoom in right here. You can you could barely see it at all. So just kind of move your mouse around until it gets the clicky thing. You get the shed key. Apparently, you can get in the attic, but nobody nobody has actually found the key yet. So that that sucks. Oh, also look at this. You could uh you could uh if you plug that in, look water starts to come up. It's the most incredible thing. Maybe you put it down. See and then. It's staying there, so when I stop it, the water goes back. I don't know. It's just that, that those little details. I, okay, I'm going to the basement. So you know how Chuck Lloyd complained about, like, the crows pecking at his garden over here? He go, he said, peck, 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 pecking at everything! I think, like, a lot of people have said, like, oh, the crows are, like, the devil's bird. To me, it kind of sounds like the crows are against Chuck Lloyd, like, is he hiding, like, dead bodies under, like, in his garden? I don't know. But right now, I gotta look for the crow, um, because you gotta, like, the crow just goes in kind of, like, random spots on this side of the yard, and you gotta, like, the crow, at first, I thought you had to hit the crow with the shovel, but the crow t shows you where he's, um, hiding the basement key, so, like, the crow is, like, on your side, I think. Oh, also, I haven't been talking to Chuck Lloyd at all. Uh, well, he hasn't talked to me. This was his last, uh, 37 messages to me. It sucks. It's, it's so hard to find the crow in the darkness, because the crow is dark, 
So you kind of had to wait. All right, so if you don't feel like waiting until uh, daytime, you can kind of like lower your camera and see, I see the crow right over there. So like anything will like stick out of the ground. You know what I mean? You'll be able to see it better because the sky's brighter. So I, yeah, so initially I thought you were hitting the crow and I was like, this sound doesn't really make sense. Well, it's the crow showing you where the key is. The crow's on your side, boy. Yeah, that's why I think uh, he's actually like hiding like a body under uh, the plants over there. Whoa, oh my God, dude, come on. You can't just, you can't just put a shadow person right. I hate that. I hate that so much. All right, let me in the basement. Just let me in. Into the basement we go. Okay, so once you're down here, uh, okay. The code you gotta say is darkness incarnate. Or you, I think you gotta be really close to this wall right here. Darkness, okay, darkness incarnate. Then look what happens. Wall go up, wall make noise. That's how you know you did it. I had to go on a alt account because, uh, people swarm me. And there, is there a battery on the bottom right? Do I have to, like, save... Do I have to save this? If you if you listen in, there's like there's a whispering. Alright. Ah, uh, what is this? Why can't I get in here? So Kazdom, he gave me the codes for the door. So this one. Okay, this should be the door. Sara. Or no, not sorry. Saro. Okay, so this I, I think I got the wrong code. So these are all the codes, and the man that's pictured on the thing, that's actually a man right there. And that's Father. Uh, I think that should be love, right? So all the dudes mentioned are on Goldity's friends list. So Father Grim. So let me try this. Love. Oh, it worked! Haha, <laughs> nobody's around me. <laughs> oh god, I don't like this. What happens when my batteries go out? What do I do then? What do I do? What do I do here? It doesn't say anything. Is there something I have to steal? Oh! So it looks like I'm supposed to type something into here, because, I mean, ugh, do you understand that one, Father Grimm? The only two keys we got are Father's, a darkness and the light. Okay, so, the, oh, that was a code in, uh, the, like, from, like, five months ago when we explored. Oh, God! Oh, my God! Okay, that's, do I, mwah, what do I do? So, wait, are you supposed to be able to, like, activate all of these? Oh, God. Oh, God. All right, let me just open this back up. You gotta say love for that. So, a darkness and light. That's one of the codes from, like, five months ago. All right. Well, <laughs> there's a man under that. Okay, I don't think there's any use for that room, or at least not that anybody knows of. There's only two known codes. One for Father Grimm's and one for Chuck's, which you say darkness incarnate. So, I go walking around for him real quick. Uh, man, I hate this place. Sometimes the noises in this game will get, like, really intense. Like, really intense, and I hate it. Man, I <laughs> I hate this. I have a, like, I, I always feel like when I when I walk through these, I feel like something's gonna pop out at me. I know that's not, like, Chuck Lloyd's style. But that's kind of what makes it even worse. I don't know what to expect. And what happens when we, like, unlock all five of those? My battery's starting to run out a little bit. Ugh! What are these noises? I hate that! Jeez. Why won't it shut up? It's getting worse. Wait, what was this? Did I just walk through here? Oh, God, I'm lost already. <laughs> I'm lost. Was I just so... Okay, no, I wasn't just over here. What was that? Could that have been a crow? Oh, God. I I don't remember where I went. Fell in love with a boy. His name is Kent. This sucks. Oh, God. Eeny, meeny, miny. Uh, mow this way. Because, bro, where am I going? Have you guys even, like, found anything here? Because I this is uncomfortable for me. Have I been over here? Man, I, I'm going to be so angry when my flashlight runs out of juice. You can't zoom in all the way, so it's so hard to, like, navigate everything. Ah, oh, man. I, I wish I knew, like... If, if these, like, bookcases provided anything for me. I feel like I'm getting, like, deeper into the tomb, though. So, yeah, like, like I said, I assume once all the codes are found, uh, you gotta activate them in the game, and then something terrible probably happens. Or maybe something good. Okay, what's this now? Ew, what's that? <laughs> What is that? Oh, wait, I've seen those before. I'll show you guys later, but... Oh, God. What happens if I fall in there? I ain't gonna risk it. Oh, so that shows I've activated the Father Grimm one. Oh, my God. Yeah, can we... Not today. Not today. Uh, where did I... Where did I come from? Where did I come from? 
Did I just say speedy? My editor? <laughs> this sucks. This is a big bad one. Even if we all find the codes, how are we supposed to figure out how to get back here? Okay, so one, two, three up there. Let me, four, five. It sucks how you're on like a time limit. That makes this so much harder. Even if we knew all the codes, we'd have to do it within this amount of time, and then find where that area is. So that's where you go when you unlock everything. But I physically cannot unlock everything because I, I only have two of the codes with me. It's so much easier to get lost in this one. I was just over here. Man, are you kidding me? Oh my God, wait. Wait, I was just, what is this? Okay, I don't think I was just there. What's that? Just r random bone? Come on. Okay, I have not been there yet. Now I gotta make the decision. Do I go that way or that way? One of them will probably take me to somewhere I've already been before. Wait, I just come from there. <gasps> Bird cages for the crows. That one looks open. Did, a, did the crow get through? And then let's like start pecking Chuck Lloyd's head. More bird cages. Okay. Well, we got in here. Oh, there we go. We found one. So that's, so that's masquerades. And I say wisdom. Wisdom. Aha, there we go. So what is Masquerade's thing? All right, uh, where is it? Okay, right here. Uh, so I found Chuck Lloyd's thing, Sorrow. All right, Sorrow. Eee! <laughs> All right, so this one, I put Darkness Incarnate. Oh God, okay, there we go. I did that, I did, I, I did do that. So there's three more that literally nobody knows and nobody's probably ever gonna find out ever again. How do I get out of here? Wait, Sorrow. So you gotta say Sorrow to get in that one. I don't know what it has to do with uh, Chuck Lloyd himself. Maybe he's very, very sorry about all the bad things he's done. Oh, so once you walk into the basement, that one is a hard right. And then you get the Chuck Lloyd's thing. Goodbye. No, my hand. It got to my hand. I want to try to find my way back to the, the big door where, like, the red glowy thing was. That's, like, the final stage. The big door room. Uh, okay, wait. I think I'm on the right trick. This... Okay, wait. So, okay, so I'm kind of memorizing this place. So, uh, right here. No, uh, right here. So, that's Masquerade's thing. You say wisdom to get there, so... But nobody knows how to do anything past it. So, it's like, once you go through the Chuck Lloyd, keep going, take a left. Things with the bird cages, you find that. I'm just trying to, like, memorize uh, this whole thing. So, once I do find out the codes, or if somebody tells me the codes, which is probably what's gonna happen. Alright, they just came running from this way, so I'm gonna go this way. Okay, and then you have Taroa's right there. So, once... Okay, so, uh, I went down... This way is Masquerades. You come up here. You keep going. You're, you're still walking, boy. Then you have Taroas. And to get in there, fear. Yeah, so there he is. Nobody knows his code. Maybe the people that, like, hacked my account and stole, like, a 500,000 Robux Dominus a long time ago, but I got it back. Uh, you know, maybe they could just have, like, a random thing generator and be able to figure this out. Hey, hackers, uh, instead of stealing... No! Instead of stealing money from me, how about you, uh... I mean, how about you figure out where Taroa, uh, how to get through that? Okay, so after the masquerade thing, which was down there, you make a right, and then the thing is right over, over there. I'm just saying this for my own peace of mind, so I don't have to wander here blindly for, like, an hour again. Okay, so, uh, for anyone who doesn't know all of this Chuck Lloyd stuff, in the basement, all the people mentioned are a part of Shade Light. So, the reason why we meet with these myths and stuff, we kind of need to, like, find out their information, kind of get on their side, like, masquerades. I kind of, me and Adam went there, there's masquerades right there. We kind of screwed up with him. Uh, <laughs> we kind of screwed around too much, so we're not really- We're not really on Masquerade's side right now, or we want to. That's probably the only way we'll find out, like, his code for the thing. And then Taroa over here. I actually have a chance, because Taroa- Look, the Taroa Show, a program for kids. Multiple people have told me, hey, you can- you, I'm pretty much the only one who can get to Taroa, because I am a YouTuber. I make content. Taroa, the Taroa show. He makes content technically because he has the Taroa show. That makes sense, right? And this is the thing. I don't know what this is, but this is the thing that was a uh, rumor in the gate room. We we saw like uh four of these. I think they were holding something though. 
this was that. It appears in these little guys' games. See, all of Father Grimm's friends from, like, there all the way from there. They're part of these nursery rhymes and stuff, and uh, that figure appears in their games. Specifically, Humpty Dumpty's. I don't- I can't- I tried for, like, 30 minutes to get back to it. I couldn't find where it was in his game, but that's what that was, so, yeah. So, yeah, I'll probably make another video on Chuck Lloyd when he- when we find out, or when other people find out the codes, and I can go test it out, because they told me what the codes are. I'm really, really excited to actually start to, like, figure more stuff out about this, though. Did you wish this happened? Oh, my God. Okay, why are there boxes everywhere? This is, like, the second server. Did people hack this? Bro, this is gonna overflow. I am surrounded by idiots. No. Truck Lloyd will never tell us the rest of the codes if we, uh... Run his water bill up. Just look at that. See how it slowly goes down. That's, that's craftsmanship. Well, somebody already used this, but just... It's craftsmanship. Look at that. Go for it. Harulito! Look at that. Look at that. That's the urine. That, I can smell it. But yeah, another thing I really want to do with Chuck Lloyd is I want to get in the, the attic. I don't know if he'll take me in there. He probably won't take me in there because he was really, really angry as you saw from the beginning of the video. But yeah, that's all I got on Chuck Lloyd today. Yeah, comment if you find uh, anything different in the uh, in the basement than what I found. I, I read a lot of the comments, trust me. I can't respond to all of them, so I respond to very few. But I, I still take in, like, if you guys find some information, like some of you you guys found uh there's a note over here somewhere oh right here there's a note that says hail the king and that is a reference to claus aconite uh the greatest king apparently so yeah i'll come back to you guys when i have more and uh better information about everything because the stuff's kind of tough out here people are investigating for hours you guys have been investigating for many hours like at one point there was like 600 or more people here and that's pretty weird and insane so Good job to you guys! Yeah, thanks for all the support on that last video. I, I, these videos are important to me and important to my soul. So I appreciate that because I really love these videos. So yeah, again, uh, I'll come back to you when I got more information. But right now, I don't got, don't, don't got much.